To get started, I just added some footage to my timeline, and since I have some cuts, I like to zoom in with an adjustment layer. Alright, let's begin by going over to the project panel and right clicking anywhere in the empty space. Go to New Item Adjustment Layer. Then drag your adjustment layer onto the timeline above where you want to zoom into your clips. And I'm just going to drag the end of my adjustment layer to increase its duration. Next, let's go over to the effects panel and type transform into the search box. Under distort, drag the transform effect onto your adjustment layer. Then make sure your adjustment layer is selected and go up to effect controls. In effect controls, scroll down to the transform effect you just added. Position the time marker to where you want to start your zoom in the adjustment layer. I'm just going to put mine right at the start. Click the stopwatch toggle next to scale to create a starting keyframe. And I'm also going to click the stopwatch next to position to create a starting keyframe for my position. Move the time marker to where you want your clip to be zoomed in by. Increase the scale to your liking to create a second keyframe. Then change the position value so that your clip is zoomed in where you want it to be. This will also create a second keyframe for your position. Okay, and now my clip zooms in using my adjustment layer. To make your zoom go faster or slower, drag to select your second keyframe for position and scale. Drag them further away from your first keyframes to make the zoom go slower. Drag them closer to your first keyframes to make the zoom go faster. Now if you want your zoom to be smoother, drag to select all your keyframes. Right click one of them and hover over Temporal Interpolation. Select Ease In or Ease Out. Okay, that looks smoother. Now to zoom out, all you have to do is position the time marker to where you want to start zooming your footage back out. Click the little circle between the two arrows next to position to create a keyframe at the current position. Then click the little circle next to scale to create a keyframe at the current scale. Move the time marker to where you want your clip to be zoomed out by. Drag to select your first keyframe for position and scale. Then right click one of the selected keyframes and select copy. Finally, right click anywhere in the empty space and select paste to paste the keyframes at the time marker's location. Okay, and now when I play this back, my clip zooms in and then zooms out. Thanks for watching and see you next time.